Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm currently getting ready. It is 8 a.m. I'm gonna go on a nice walk with my father. I have really been loving my weekends in Texas in quarantine. Um, I've just been really focusing on having like actual like relaxing weekends and like spending time reading, extra time cooking, like things I really, really love. And I think it's been nice to not like pack my weekends with things that I need to do and want to do. It's been really nice having just like weekends at home that are a little more slow. Love that. I actually am going somewhere tomorrow, which is exciting. Um, I feel like I have to preface this in every video. Texas has lifted stay at home and I believe we're at a 50% capacity now. I haven't really um, been going many places. I might like pick up coffee this morning or something, but okay, I'm ready. Anyways, I am gonna go um, somewhere tomorrow. Obviously like wearing masks and stuff, that's like totally okay. Also guys, the way hair products have been helping my hair so much, it's really dead. Like I need a haircut really bad, but it has just really brought it back to life. So I've really been loving that. I also need to make a video public. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna make a little espresso shot. I've never made one from home, but look at this cute little um, espresso shot glass. It's glass I got on Amazon. It's not the exact same as the coffee mugs that I use every day. Those are from William Sonoma, but here we go, guys. This is exciting. Okay, this is gonna be interesting for sure. The lighting in my house is wild right now. Let me see if I can fix this. I don't think I can. That's not gonna do anything. It's like literally beautiful and there's always rainbows on my table. I normally chug like an entire glass of water before I drink any coffee, but since this is just an espresso shot, I feel like, you know, I need to go to Costco and buy in bulk because those are so expensive. Are you ready for this? Coco, are you excited for your walk? Are you excited for your walk? Oh my gosh, you look so cute today, girl. Are you excited for your walk? Guys, I found an old video of Coco with the perfect hair length. I have never seen her look cuter, ever. I'm gonna start showing this photo to all the groomers and be like, why are you not doing this? So good. Okay, ready? It's hot, obviously. <sighs> Maybe I'll just start taking espresso shots in the morning. <laughs> Okay, that was like my strongest pod. It's not the worst thing I've ever had, but I'm also like really good at doing that stuff. So, shots are like my hidden talent. Um, wellness, all of them, you know? Well, hopefully that helps me. I'm gonna do uh, some of the dishes and then my dad is gonna get here and then we're gonna go on a walk. to show you guys what I'm wearing. So these are my favorite shorts from Outdoor Voices. I'm um, sorry about the dishwasher. I tried to link them in the video I just posted today and they're not on the site, but I'll keep looking and figure it out for you guys because I'm obsessed with them. I want like 15 of them. I'm gonna live in them all summer. Black tank top from Misguided. This exact one, which I'll link this exact one, is great quality, it's super inexpensive. I've gotten other ones from them and they're like too cropped and stuff, so I'll only like wear it around the house. Um, and even then sometimes I'm like wearing it in vlogs and so like I pull my pants up all the way because it's just like really cropped um, So anyways, I really like this specific one. I'll have it linked down below, but it's really great I have a white one as well, and then this I'm just gonna throw over my shoulders um, Very country club mom of me guys. I almost wore a visor, uh, but I didn't I don't have a visor I have a baseball cap, but um, This is from Aritzia. So that is my outfit. Okay. I'm gonna do my quick Devo and then head out as always 40 day prayer challenge. It's my favorite one ever Also, I'm having one of these for breakfast. They are seriously just the best. I really like the vanilla bean flavor So good. All right guys. Hello. I said you have to say hello to the vlog. So he goes hello Um, oh my gosh, you have so many dogs. Yes. My dad copied me and got Lucy come here Coco's not being nice. This is Lucy I don't know why that's smudged. Okay, so we're gonna go on a walk now. It's been real. Aw, Coco looks so cute. I've been getting 
crazy and I don't know, I just don't know what's going on. Because I've had caffeine, so part of me is like, maybe it's like a hormonal thing. I don't really know what's going on, honestly. I stopped at La La Land. It's like totally safe. You sit outside, social distancing. It's been open for like a month probably now. Um, so yeah, I went with my friend Liz, and then I think I'm going tomorrow again with Liz to First Mondays, which is like a flea market type thing in Canada. It's like an hour away, so we're gonna go to that. Um, and then I think she's probably coming over today before anyone comments Obviously, I'm being so over-the-top safe about social distancing. I really don't leave my house That was like really something but we're like taking the right precautions wearing masks all that stuff And you can like social distance and it's totally fine here. It's been lifted for a while. We're already at 50% capacity um, I haven't even gone to like a restaurant. I don't really want to go to a restaurant still. I have another package from oh my gosh <laughs> From Killa Dice that is seriously not real. Not real. Okay, so she gave me another matching um, set. So this goes with one of my hoodies that's upstairs. My crew next, I mean, so cute. I know she's like really popping off this quarantine, but she literally made me a matching like outfit for Coco. I'm literally dying. Coco, she's sleeping somewhere. She is really had the best time ever today, but she's tired now, but guys, that is so funny. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. That was just, oh my gosh. That was seriously so cute. Brooke will be proud of me. I finally got an iPhone tripod because all of my photos are mirror pictures, which I'm fine with. I actually prefer mirror pictures. Um, but I felt like I needed to spice it up because my Instagram is literally all mirror pictures right now, which isn't good. So anyways, I have to figure out this headache. I need to fight, I need to eat. Um, and I'm gonna actually figure out what I'm making and order groceries. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna go lay out today. It's just, maybe I'll do some editing. I just love my slow weekends where I don't have like 15 things I have to go to. It's so nice. Liz is coming over in a few hours. Um, my headache is like killing me. So I'm gonna drink a Sprite cause like maybe that'll help. Um, and some Ritz crackers and just lay down in the dark and watch um some shows update on the den i'm gonna have to switch there's still more to be done guys there's always gonna be more to be done i haven't even like changed yet because my head just hurts so bad like oh my gosh i don't know why i keep having these really bad headaches but hi coco <laughs> okay guys my stomach really hurts i have a really bad headache and it's just not the best anyways it's almost three my grocery just got delivered i was just downstairs trying to nap and it like didn't really work i watched a few shows some jessica simpson youtube videos the usual anyways oh my gosh my stomach hurts <laughs> groceries have been delivered i'm gonna show you guys a grocery haul since you guys seem to really like those this week i am making this like you guys will see tonight what i'm making and then i'm also gonna make like chicken lettuce wraps and then i just got a few other things i have home chef coming on monday so um, most of my meals i'm gonna make from that but i got a lot of chicken broth um because i just been making a lot of stuff in my crock pot especially lately and it always calls for that and i used it all more balsamic vinaigrette for my salads i go through that pretty quickly so i got two and then i got soy sauce seasoned rice vinegar and another sauce for the chicken lettuce wraps dave's bread the best bread ever um some mushrooms for what i'm making today blueberries more mushroom the big dish then this is for the lettuce wraps butter lettuce more olive oil green onions Lots of ginger, more onions, because all I do is cook with onions. You literally go through so many onions when you're a chef, you know? I got three pounds, unreal. That will be for tonight. Ground chicken breast for my chicken lettuce wrap. So, that is everything I picked up for right now. My mom is texting me. Um, but I'm gonna get started, I think. What is it, three? Yeah, I'm gonna get started on um my meal today because it takes about four hours it's a crock pot thing so um yeah i'm gonna go ahead and prep that i'm actually not gonna show this in a vlog i'm actually gonna show this in a vlog and not on like a tiktok or anything because i just like don't feel good enough to like do anything more than that okay guys i am making braised beef with red wine liz is coming over she brought this over um like last week and hated it so it's actually perfect because it's what i need in this recipe 
uh, mushrooms, beef, tomato paste, carrots, all this stuff. Um, I don't know if that's everything. I feel like it is, but I'm going to make it in my um, crock pot. So I just browned the meat. Um, I'm currently sauteing the vegetables. I'm gonna add in garlic in a second. And then we add in tomato paste. I'll kind of just take you guys with me. Um, this isn't like technically a cookie with Kinsey, but just a little behind the scenes. Just added in some tomato paste and then I'm gonna add some flour so it can be thicker. So I just, I don't remember what I last vlogged, um, but it is slow cooking. I don't know why that timer is even on. I need to fix that. Um, it's right above the wine line, and then I just coated it and put time, like literally, put seasoning, like literally all over it. Um, anyways, you have to let this sit for about like two and a half hours, I want to say, maybe three hours. Um, I'm going to put a timer on because I don't know why it's even doing that, but... Okay, I'm gonna do two hours and 30 minutes. So, anyways, it's gonna break down. Just be a beautiful, we're braising this, amazing. All right guys, we're on the roof. Literally, my self-tanner has stained my swimsuit. So perfect, we're taking photos. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm really hungry, food will be done in like 10 minutes. Okay guys, this has been done. It looks amazing, but it's just, I mean, it smells so good. We just are craving pizza. I actually made this for my family anyway, so we're getting pizza, pasta, garlic knots, all of it, because it just sounds so good, um, which is fine, because this was for my family, technically, so I just didn't really care about eating it tonight. It's just kind of like a meal prep thing, but it looks amazing, and it smells so freaking good. Okay, we got dinner. Very exciting. Here we go again with our scary movies. Okay, so it is currently nine. Liz just left. I actually started watching Defending Jacob um, on Apple TV. I think I might even start. I don't want to start from the very beginning because I'm already one episode in. It's really good so far. My mom texted me and was like, you have to watch this. So that's what we've been watching. This may be the first night in so long that I haven't read before bed. I literally have read every single night for like the past two months. Oh, nope, still not working before bed, but I kind of think I'm just gonna fall asleep here. It's very interesting, very new for me. Good morning, everyone. It is Sunday morning. I'm about to get ready to head off to the flea market. Good morning, everyone. I just put my hair through the Dyson Airwrap. Um, yeah, honestly, I'm just in such a like ugh, mood. I know I've already mentioned it all, and it's not that it's ever like, you know, not worth mentioning, but it's just like, you know, I think also people come to YouTube as like an escape as well. Um, with that being said, it doesn't need to be like ignorant, like you need to be informed and educated and doing things, but just for some lighthearted content sometimes. Um, so I'm still trying to do that while also being like, this is a very, very big problem. I mean, I've posted a bunch uh, to my Instagram. The graphics that are going by really literally my best friend Dom and it's like incredible. Um, but we're just, we've been FaceTiming like every day and we're gonna do a podcast episode as well. Um, a lot of you guys have been requesting that, but also I'm just like so mad right now. Um, also I just think, I don't know. I just think it's so important. So we were just FaceTiming about all that and she was calling me because her account keeps getting blocked and all this stuff and it's just like, it's crazy and I know there's probably people which blows my mind that watch this video and still like don't and I know there's probably people who are watching this video who like still don't believe racism exists somehow even after all of this stuff and I just like really encourage you to like I don't know at this point like I literally don't know what to tell you like I mean, it, it's a thing. It, like, really does exist. <laughs> like, there are people who are literally dying. Anyways, I just... Obviously, this is, like, weighing, like... I feel like it's so stupid saying it's weighing so heavily on my heart. Like, I'm white and privileged. Like, it's nothing in comparison to what, like, anyone else is facing. Um, but I just want to say, like, I hear you guys. I'm with you guys. With that being said, Dom and I are going to do an entire podcast episode um just on like the topic and i want it to be very like informational for you guys and for myself like i'm constantly trying to learn and entertain like i am not perfect in this like 
I'm doing my absolute best with like using a platform and speaking out um, and just being educated, like knowing what I'm talking about. So, sorry, I just like felt so weird not talking about it because that's been like my morning. I it's just so crazy because it's like, I can't like, uh, I like don't wanna cry. Like I cannot imagine what it's like living this way and feeling this and like every day, like I, I just like am so, sorry and like i feel stupid again for even saying sorry because it's like you know what i mean like it's it's just so big like so big so with that being said i'm gonna try to get in a better mood i need to show you guys my makeup routine ish which sounds stupid i'm talking about this but it's okay um okay so oh, guys i'm just like i'm so sorry like so sorry um also if there are like more ways that you guys think i can do more things or like you know i'm literally always down to hear um like constructive criticism i'm not even like i'm not offended i think it's so interesting how people are like oh my gosh i'm being bullied for not speaking out about it and it's like you're somehow making this about yourself like obviously it's like you post anything unrelated and people are like attacking you right now and it's like it's literally not about you. Like, if people do that to me, I'm like, you're hurting, and I see that, and I hear that, and I know that. I'm not going to make this about me. Like, and people are still doing that somehow. And I'm just like, what? Anyways, so if there's any things that you guys think I can do more, um, any ideas you guys have, any like anything along that sort, I'm literally more than open to hearing it. Um, anything I'm doing wrong, whatever, just, like, please let me know. So, okay, I'm just gonna tell you guys what I've been doing on my makeup, which again sounds so stupid. Um, I did Super Goop, obviously my glow screen underneath, Charlotte Tilbury Wonder Glow. It's pretty similar to like what I have been doing. I'm trying to like really bronze up my face right now. Even though I like don't really need to. I use, okay, so the self tanner I used was the one that Julia Havens always talks about on Pretty Little Thing. And I loved it. I will say, like, a lot of it washed off, so it looks a lot more, like, natural than it did yesterday. Like, yesterday was a lot, but I was still, like, with it. You know what I mean? Blush. Blush is really... If you don't wear blush, you need to, because it really changes the game. I kind of just, like, randomly put it around my face, too, to have more color. I guess my favorite makeup right now really is Charlotte Tilbury. Like, it's what I use 24-7. Back to this palette. I think this bronzer is the best bronzer ever, too. I'm just, like, I love the highlight. Also, this is like even more controversial. Like I know that so many people are gonna like hate me, but especially if you're a Christian and you're not like, your heart isn't breaking for people, like pray for empathy because I don't understand like how you can be Christian and like hate people. Like it doesn't, it just like doesn't work like that, like at all. Um, so, I know I'm back to this, but um, this is literally like the angriest like makeup routine ever, but I'm so sorry. But like in all seriousness, I'm really trying to like, okay, I'm trying to like not come at people, but like especially, I think any human being, regardless of what you believe, but especially Christians need to be like using their voice right now and like standing up and talking about everything that's going on and it's just like yeah so i'm even i'm like extremely concerned if you are a christian and you don't feel anything about this like especially you're supposed to be like fighting for people and like unity and, and like in order to get unity like people need to be heard it's not like oh like this is just gonna be peaceful immediately like no you need to be fighting for people and yeah so i love all of you guys um, I just like really really care about this and I really really just I don't know I nothing I say will ever be enough ever. I don't think anything anyone says will be enough, but um, Yeah, uh, I'm putting on this is literally feels like the weirdest video I've ever filmed. Um, I'm putting on Mascara I'm about to set my face and then I'm gonna change so Liz and I are going to the flea market. Yesterday when we were laying out, we talked to Dom for a while too. And I've just been learning so much from her and her Instagrams as well. My best friend, Maddie Trapp, you guys know her, um, growing up and still like now to this day, has always like informed me and just been like very proactive and like Black Lives Matter and just like 
very educational and like she's the biggest heart but she also just like she knows what she's talking about um so because of her growing up honestly i really solely credit it to her because i grew up in a very like white privileged you know area like that's i feel like that's most of us like i mean that's everyone white privilege but you know what i mean um i feel like because of her i grew up with a lot more awareness to the matter like i've always always been like racism exists but i think um she really helped open my eyes at like a younger age to a lot of what was going on and she really educated herself and she really took the time and like i'm really grateful for her especially in times like this because i'm so glad that um i was just made aware younger you know like i'm really grateful for that um i also go over this with this wonder glow just so everyone's aware um so I'm really grateful, but I just think like now is the time to educate ourselves, donate. Um, a lot of people are messaging me like, why don't you donate? I have been donating. I just feel weird. It's this like weird thing because if you post that you donated, it makes it look like you're trying to like amplify yourself. But if you don't post that you're donating, people don't think that you did it. So I, I chose to not post that I donated, which maybe was the wrong thing. Like, please inform me on like what I should be doing. I have shared where to donate though. So like, I don't know if, you know what I mean? Like, am I supposed? I don't know. I don't like the last thing I want to do is like amplify myself in this. So I'm gonna calm down, um, and then we'll go on. It just feels weird to like go on with the day, but I will have places to donate, places petitions to sign, all that stuff linked down below. Actually, especially I will have Dom's Instagram page because I would rather give you one link to where you can see everything at once. So I'm gonna give you guys Dom's Instagram link because she has like where you can donate, where you can do positions, all of that stuff, as well as like more content on like how to help and be an ally. Here's my outfit, ignore the pillows. The shams are not here yet. Um, So I actually think maybe I have lost weight because I remember these jeans being like more snug, but like, I, I don't know. I mean, I don't know what's happening. Maybe these are just, maybe these just haven't been washed. I don't know. I forgot I even had these sheets, honestly. They're girlfriend denim, just because I haven't been wearing jeans. Um, I have a white tank on. My current fave purse, Air Force Ones. It's just like a very chill look. I have these dresses that I'm bringing in case it's like too hot and I just want to change. I don't know, we're being extra, but we're driving like an hour away. So I've really packed up. Um, that has like sunscreen and stuff in it. And then also a bunch of like just athletic wear that like I'm not wearing that Liz can have because she needs some and I need to get rid of some. So there we are. I'm going to have a mush for breakfast, fill up a water bottle and we're off. Wow, this is literally so Texas and we're listening to country music. Liz and I, okay guys, this is like actually not okay. We, oh yeah, okay, it's, so I FaceTimed her and she was like coming and I was waiting and then we were wearing the exact same outfit. I mean, it's not like it's a revolutionary outfit in our defense, so it's fine. We're hoping, they, they definitely don't take Venmo. No, 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 no. But what are we gonna do? Is there an ATM know. close? What if, okay. Okay. <laughs> what if we just <laughs> flirt our way through it? That's insane. I, I think, okay, we're just gonna try to flirt, guys. I've done it before. I'm not a good flirt, except for if I'm trying to get something that I want. Oh, no. Oh, no. They really only Oh, my God, wait. Cash. He's literally right here. Okay, okay. this is so awkward. Okay. Hold on one second. Okay. You only take cash, huh? Yes. Okay. Where's the closest ATM? Uh, I'm not sure. There's gonna be one in there, but if you want to just get cash while you're in there, maybe on the way out. That's okay, fine. I have three dollars, but I'll... honestly, it's fine. <laughs> okay, thank perfect. You. Thank you. Thank you so much. We love him. <laughs> I didn't even try, but he was just so <laughs> he nice. He took no effort at all. He's he like, was just like, sure. You know what? Yeah, sure. yeah. <laughs> so basically, this is like a really big flea market. Neither of us have ever been, but like, it's so popular. So we just drove, it was only like 50 minute drive, listen to country music. It's just really been a, been a good vibe. Um, I'm excited. I definitely am getting hungry now that you say I'm that gonna, though. I'm really starving right now. Yeah. But it's not even. It's like not even 11, I don't think. Yeah. Our original plan was to get here even earlier. <laughs> and like it just <laughs> didn't happen. Real. Finally we got to the she's like, yeah, we're gonna eventually get there. Like <laughs> at some point. So, oh my gosh. Don't worry guys, we will be taking proper precautions. We will be wearing masks, all that stuff. Cold pork sandwiches with soup baby raised barbecue sauce, guys. Little booth that Liz found for $2. It's gonna be great decor. Putting it in the car, but it looks amazing. And a strawberry lemonade. 
Guys, seriously, I mean, Liz found both of these, but my Best Buy's legit ever. Like, $2, $25. I've never seen something more me in my entire life. Very successful. <laughs> I'm... Yeah, okay, well we were trying to find a bar card for, like, there's just nothing here for bar cards unfortunately, but we're still on the hunt. Back from the flea market, I also got a new pair of sunglasses because I broke my Amazon ones yesterday. I don't know where I put them, where are they? Right here, okay. They were like $10, I love getting um, little sunglasses at the flea market. Anyways, I'm gonna go shower obviously, do all that stuff now that I've been in public. Um, but... Literally so obsessed with this hat. This is the best thing I've ever purchased as well as this like this was two dollars Oh my gosh guys. I just love it. Hi guys. Okay. Um, I'm really really tired and Just like sad. Um, so Dallas actually just said curfew um, You would not be able to access these areas. So I guess for several days, we have a curfew at 7 p.m. I want to like educate myself even more, so I think I'm gonna watch some documentaries and things too. It's only like 3 p.m. or it's 4 p.m. now. Um, I have leftovers from last night, so I might just make those. And I might bring my laptop down and stop start editing or something. I don't really know. I want to go to the den, but uh, I, it's just like so dark that I just fall asleep. Um, okay, so first Mondays was fun. Um, I just feel so weird filming. Um, first Mondays was fun. We got some things. Um, it, I already showed you guys. I just am like going on and on. Also the Maui, um, oh my gosh, my ringtone guys. The Maui Bay Browning Lotion, ooh, is um, incredible. I really, really love this stuff. I actually think I got tan, like I saw a tan line when I was just showering and changing. And I was like, wait a second, because I used it yesterday, but I was like, had self tanner on, so I just like couldn't tell. Um, I also have bug bites all over my legs, and there's always mosquitoes in Texas, so please tell me what to do. Like, I don't want to wear bugs. I mean, obviously, no bug spray, but like, is there something better than bug spray? Because there's literally bites all over my legs, and it's just not cute, and it hurts. So, yeah. Wow. I'm not actually gonna wear this. Don't worry. It really, truly is just decor. So, here we go. Great, guys. It's like I have pizza downstairs, and I could heat that up, but I mean, I need to do that, actually. I decided I'm actually, well, it looks weird without the other one lit. Um, I'm actually going to hang out in my room. I have pizza, garlic knots. Um, I'm going to turn my TV on, watch some documentaries to kind of educate myself, get some stuff together, maybe even more resources, I think, for... Um, I love you so much because I, I don't feel like I've shared enough on that Instagram So I'm gonna try to get some like books and stuff to read going to end off um, The vlog by just doing like skincare, I guess <laughs> like, I don't know guys I'm uh, gonna use like, pretty much the last of my Sonya Dakar face cleanser, which is like my favorite right now I need to tan my face Gosh, My face is always so red after I like wash it this is what I shared in my last favorites video, and you guys are so right, duh. The reason that my self tanner isn't working as much is because I started using retinol, but the thing is, like, I haven't really used my retinol, like, routinely, honestly, like, very well lately, so I'm also like, maybe that isn't why. So it is 5 p.m., and I'm just gonna watch some documentaries and just educate myself tonight. So I'm starting off with the 13th. Hope you guys enjoyed um, this weekend of my life vlog. I love you guys so much. I will have places linked down below that you can donate to. Um, also, of course, if I'm telling you guys to do something, I'm doing the same. I would never tell you guys to do something that I'm not going to do. So, love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye.